Thunderdome podcast episode nine living room edition uh it's a little loud in my garage right now so we're going to do it from here um just real quickly you know we're done with everything we need to do with chapter 11 and personality um so in saying that um let's go over the new question that i posted on Rue is seven years old and has been home with her parents for over 50 days. Before school was suspended, Rue had restrictions on sugar and caffeine intake after 3 p.m. She also had a specific bedtime routine that started at 8.15 p.m. and ended with Rue fast asleep by 9 p.m. However, over 50 days into quarantine, she is now falling asleep between 11 p.m. and 12 p.m and has been noticeably more irritable and reactionary. So here we go. Here comes the question part. What effect would these terms on ha- what effect would these terms have on Rue's life before quarantine? Authoritative parents and stimulants. Number 2. According to Pavlov and Watson, what are some ways you can attribute these classical conditioning terms to Rue's life deep into quarantine? Condition stimulus and extinction. What would one, and then finally, number three, what would one biological reason be that Rue is noticeably more irritable and reactionary? You don't get a bullet point for that one. Okay. You get, you get a question that's kind of open-ended and it allows you to be creative. So again, the directions, uh, for this, um, you know, define underline, use all caps since we're typing and apply, separate your answers for each term by a single space in between answering terms. If a section of the question has a part without a term associated with, with it, you must answer it. It will have several options for answers and becomes a part of the question that you can use more creativity to answer it with. We want to foster this skill in answering free response questions. Uh, just don't forget to define and apply uh, in that part of the question as well. Um, we've had some people answer already. Tuesday, so it'll give us a little bit more time um, to, you know, you'll have time to look at the question and go over it. Um, Again, define, underline, and apply those things. Um, You know, one, there's like a storm going on right now, so it's a little crazy. Uh, My wife opened her business back up today, um, and... uh, just got off the phone with her and she was fighting uh if you know anything about her restaurant um it's an outdoor restaurant and it's got like flaps all over the place and the flaps because of this wind like ripped off so i had to make sure she didn't fall into the river because I was a floating barge um so she's on her way home she's bringing home yosaki to go bringing home yosaki to go That's what I'm talking about. Um, Let's see what else. Um, We're going to get an update from the governor tomorrow about uh, schools. Uh, If you haven't heard already, the quarantine, you know, till April 29th has been extended to May 8th. Um, And then there's going to be three phases after that sometime. And, you know, phase one is like, parks are going to be able to reopen and retail stores and all that kind of stuff, but we'll have limitations of 10 people still. Um, and then phase two, uh, 
we will pretty much, you know, restaurants will be able to open, but have limited capacity. Uh, and then, you know, phase three, we're kind of reintroducing normal life, but you know, masks are still going to be required and not required, but at least asked to be worn most of the time. Uh, so all those updates came today. Uh, the educational update is going to be coming tomorrow. Um, you know, from what I can tell, nobody's going to fail. Nobody, not anything. Um, I think you're going to be able to have a grade of whatever you made first semester. Um, and then, you know, we'll, after that, it's going to be like COVID passing or COVID withdrawal, but nothing is going to hurt your GPA. So, uh, I don't know. It's going to be interesting to see what that looks like. Um, that's what's kind of been handed down from the state education, the board of education of North Carolina. Um, so yeah, that's what's going on there. Um, I'm on a little time crunch right now because wifey is on her way home with the Osaki. So the moment I see her come home, the, that's the moment the podcast is over because I got fiery beef noodles and crab. I usually get firecracker shrimp from there, but I'm holding off today. Um, a little update on my five miles every single weekday. I'm at 85 miles this month. 85 miles. Your boy sets goals and he achieves them. That's what he does. Um, so I'll have 100 by next Tuesday. And I've already made out my little workout plan for May. I already got it. Got a whole thing written down already. Ready to go. Birthday's May 31st. I got to get in shape for that, man. Um, so I can stay inside and cry. Um, there'll be some practice stuff released by the AP uh, College Board May 4th, I think. So you can start like doing a practice or watching a tutorial on how to actually take the exam. Um, we've been told to stress to you guys, don't cheat. And, uh, you know, remember the restrictions that I kind of told you about, you know, you can pretty much use whatever you like, but not be in contact with another person about it. Um, so you got to be careful. You can imagine they're going to be like maybe tracking your AP your, your IP address or whatever it is. I don't, I don't know. Maybe, maybe something like that is going to happen. But they, they really want to thwart, um, cheating. But at the same time, I'm telling you, if you have, you know, any reference point next to you, I would use it. So notes, um, anything like that. Um, so be figuring that out in your head a little bit um, because, again, you know, define, underline, and apply. Let's take care of that define part externally, uh, and then let's apply. Let's get really good at applying. Um, all right. I think that's it for me. Living room edition. Once in a lifetime experience. Now, I might do this more often. It was a lot more easy to set up. I just got to come up with a better place for this microphone. Um, all right, y'all take care. I'll probably do a little, uh, Instagram live sometime, maybe not tonight because of the storm or whatever, but, uh, yeah, sometime soon I'll Instagram live with y'all. Um, stay with me, play this game. Let's go.